Hello friends, I am Arun Kumar. This is our channel Chemistry Crafters with Bono. Today we are going to learn how to make toilet cleaner. The process is very simple but the quality of the product is comparable with Harpic or any other brand. Today I am going to prepare for about 1 liter. With this formula you can prepare for any number of liters. First let us see the video, making video and then we will discuss the chemistry behind toilet cleaner making. Let's get started. We are going to prepare 1 liter of toilet cleaner. First, let us keep all the raw materials ready. I have taken exact quantity. This is the plastic mug in which I am going to prepare toilet cleaner. It is 1.5 liter capacity. I am going to prepare 1 liter. So for me it is sufficient. Even you can take 2 liters of capacity. Nothing wrong. For stirring purpose, I am going to use this blender. If blender is not available, you can use a plastic spoon like that. Now, let us see all the raw materials one by one. This is 825 ml RO water. Don't use normal water or tap water. This is 15 ml of color solution. Of course, this is acid blue color. The preparation of color solution is very easy. Take 1 gram color powder and dissolve in 100 ml of RO water and use 15 ml. Instead of adding color powder, by adding solution ensures consistent coloring every time. Next, I have taken 20 grams of citric acid that is 2% acid thickener 25 ml hydrochloric acid 150 ml it is 28% concentration. Now let us start the process. First I am taking RO water. Next I am adding color solution. As soon as I add the color, it immediately mixes with water. After a few seconds of mixing, we will get homogeneous solution. Next, I am adding citric acid. Always keep your face 3 to 4 feet distance away from the reaction vessel. Now I am slowly adding acid thickener with continuous stirring. Finally, I am adding hydrochloric acid. While adding the acid, if necessary, you can use goggles and gloves. Again, stir well. Now the process is over. Now it looks like that only. Let us allow to settle for 24 hours. After the settling process of toilet cleaner, we will see it. For toilet cleaners, since it is in acid medium, we should not add any perfumes. Now toilet cleaner is ready. I will transfer it to glass beaker so that we can check its physical appearance, clarity and consistency. 
for toilet cleaner viscosity is very important parameter by using 4 cup viscometer we can check its viscosity this is 4 cup viscometer it has 4 cup of 100 ml capacity here the viscosity is nothing but the time taken by 100 ml of toilet cleaner to completely drain for toilet cleaner the ideal viscosity is from 45 to 50 seconds for toilet cleaner the manufacturing process is very simple for 1 liter the manufacturing cost will be less than 20 rupees those who are having little chemistry knowledge and safety concern can easily prepare toilet cleaner in a few minutes once you prepared for 1 liter or 2 liter you can use it for next one month or two months no need to purchase from shops okay friends now we will discuss some important points in toilet cleaner making process the first point is viscosity for toilet cleaner it should have optimum viscosity that means the viscosity should be within the range of 45 to 50 seconds too much of viscosity is a problem if toilet cleaner is too much thick it will deposit a thin layer over the surface of the toilet bowl. Even after rinsing with plenty of water, you can see the thin layer. If toilet cleaner is too much thin, then it will not stay on the surface of the toilet bowl. Right away, it will go down. So, to maintain the correct viscosity, we should maintain the correct concentration of the hydrochloric acid. The concentration of the hydrochloric acid may vary. Commercial quality may be from 20% to 32% anything is possible hydrochloric acid is actually gas it is being dissolved in water so it depends upon the concentration of the quality the thickness the consistency the viscosity will be there so before making any bulk process we should make a small trial batch around 500 ml or 1 liter with that raw material with that hydrochloric acid the second point is citric acid of course citric acid is a costly raw material but without adding citric acid, only with hydrochloric acid, the performance of the toilet cleaner is average, not good. So we need to add citric acid. Maximum 2% we can add. It will improve the performance and our toilet cleaner is comparable with branded one. Third one is a volume of hydrochloric acid. Generally in toilet cleaner, 10% volume of the hydrochloric acid is sufficient. Since we are using commercial grade, maybe around 28%, we are using 15%. This is more than sufficient. Don't try for 20% or 25%. It is not good. Because the excess concentration is not good for our health, toilet bowl and also environment. I have given the video formula in description. This is for about 1 liter. With this formula, you can convert into any number of liters. Thank you friends. Take care. We will meet in our next video. Your suggestions and feedbacks are welcome.